through the basic functions of the Pi joystick. This is a canvas joystick that we use together with the Targa or also with older systems. This is the on button which activates the communication. As you see the indication, position indications are always there. So now when I push on I can operate using this lever. So no surprising, right moves it to the right, left to the left, and up and down uh, can be set in the configuration. Watch a separate video how you change directions of the joystick. Valve will open or close your valve. Record will activate record. So pushing record will allow you to record a sequence including the nozzle control and also including the pauses. When we are done with the recording we push record again to save and now when I push play the robotic nozzle will play back the pattern that I just recorded and again it's including all the pauses and it's including all the velocity changes. This is very useful if you want to uh, spray over a, over a building, for example, for cooling purposes. So to abort playback, you just take over with the joystick. Or you can push play to abort playback. If I record a new pattern, this will ride over my old pattern. So now this new pattern is recorded. Nozzle control, as you've seen, is here on the tip of the of the shaft. The auxiliary one and auxiliary two buttons are generic. So these are specified in your system setup. Uh, they can be used for uh, changing from robotic nozzle one to robotic nozzle two, or they can also be used for controlling valves, such as foam, for example. Uh, again, these are generic and they have to be specified as part of the system setup when you order.